What's up guys and welcome to Party MMR. Uh, as you know patch 7.05 is out. So in this video we're gonna talk about some main points in this new patch that you can use to win your next game uh, to increase your rank in this new patch. So let's start. So now Midas experience reduced from 2.5 to 1.75. So it's reduced and the gold bonus increased. So now with Midas like doesn't work good with Invoker because the Invoker needs a lot of experience or some greedy supports that needs the experience. Like you can't get it now or not you can but it's like pretty much useless to get it for greedy supports that need the levels. But some greedy supports like Ancient or maybe Rubik that needs the gold you can get you can still get Midas for them. Like Midas on Invoker you won't be seeing it a lot now. But you're gonna see Midas now on heroes that work early that needs the uh, gold more than the experience like greedy supports like ancient operation and we will see midas also on early carries like life steeder or other carries that need the gold very early like legion commander is still gonna see it on them but here's that like depends on the experience it won't like it won't increase that much of the experience from before so it's better not to get them like for invoker it's better to like get something else for invoker like you might get something that can help you farm better than getting midas to increase your level now the th the next thing we're going to talk about is tranquil boots tranquil boots, there's a lot of things they changed in it first of all requires wind lands instead of ring of protection so if you're getting the tranquil boot if you're planning to get it don't get the uh, ring protection anymore like if you're axe and golden jungle uh, don't get the ring of protection okay just uh, remember that keep it in mind when you're playing heroes that can get tranquil boots now tranquil boots no longer provides any armor of course because they removed the ring of, of protection but they replaced the armor given by it by a uh, regeneration increase from 12 to 14 hp per second and an active state the movement speed the active state movement speed increased from 85 to 90 so not that big of a deal but still it's gonna affect the game and the disabled like when it's not active it's incre they increased it from 55 to 67 so that's gonna affect the game like pretty like with axe and heroes like this it's gonna affect the game early game now quilling blade does not bonus damage does not stack with iron talon so don't get them together Abaddon strength gain reduced from 2.5 to 2.3 actually this thing like they needed to decrease uh, the strength gain or reduce the strength gain for Abaddon okay it was a very OP hero actually was picked a lot in captain news if you ever watched the uh, if you ever watched the tournaments that was going on it was big they picked him a lot but now it's better actually they're trying to nerf him a little bit alchemist acid spray radius rescaled from 625 to all levels to 400 for the first level 475 for the second 550 550 for the third and 625 for the last level for the fourth level uh, that's actually was good because when you're playing alchemist as a mid hero okay or playing against you it actually was very op the ss spray you can farm you can do anything but now this the radius is reduced a lot like for the first levels so it's gonna be a it's not gonna be a big problem for the if you're playing against alchemist so that's the thing that you're playing against against alchemist remember this thing to get a range hero because now it works better now there's this thing brewmaster they got a lot of uh, updates on brewmaster spills like especially the talents but we won't, won't talk about the talents let's first talk about the uh, earth primal units demolish now gives plus 90 180 270 damage versus buildings as you know before like if you ever saw the combo if you ever saw the combo brewmaster and invoker it was very op now uh why it was a very op because it can push a lot faster than like anyone now it doesn't work like that like it, it works in the base damage the earth primal unit okay that has the the earth primal unit damage versus building now instead of the total damage they increase a 300 percent instead of the total damage that can work like before with a brewmaster and invoker now it works in the base damage 
this combo was very OP. So they reduced it for the base damage, not the total damage that the Earth Primal unit has. Now Bristleback, I really advise you to pick him now because the kill spray AOE increased, that's first of all, and level 15 and 25 talents increased like dramatically, it's very good. Like level 15 from 225, okay it's not that big, big of a deal, but when you look into level 25, for 25 plus to 30 plus uh, HP regeneration, that's actually very good. Like you, are, you better reconsider the picking yourself back because as, uh, like it's been a long time since I've seen Bristleback played in a game. Like it's very low pick rate for Bristleback, so it's time for him to go back and be picked more often. Nature Profit base damage increased by six points, so that's gonna be very good. Like when we farm jungle, it's gonna be much easier and better to farm the jungle early stage in the game and we'll get a lot of experience and gold. That actually was needed for Nature Prophet. And now Trent Protector is enabled in Captain's mood. It's been a long time since they picked him of course because he wasn't available. Now he's, av he's back because they nerfed him a little bit. They reduced the slow from Leash Seed and the overgrowth cooldown. They increased it a little bit for the early uh, levels. Tower base armor now reduced by 2 points, but they replaced this with uh, the towers now gain 1 armor per enemy unit around it, maximum 3 three points, like 3 armor points. Uh, so now it's better to push solo than actually pushing with a team. That's not that big of a deal, that's not 1 or 2 armor, won't make that much of a difference, but still. Uh, shrine's base health region reduced 10 points, like from 100 to 90 that's actually gonna affect a lot uh, the game especially like early stages when you're fighting near the shrines uh, intelligence based spell amplification increased 1% per 15 it was 1% per 16 before intelligence point XP required from level 20 to level 25 reduced for doom level 20 talent they changed to uh, from 20 plus 25 HP regeneration to devour can target ancient and they made level 25 talent from uh, devour can target ancient to plus 40 health hp regeneration that's actually a great thing for doom players like anyone who won who, who plays doom this is actually a great thing that they did for doom he's gonna be picked more in this new patch uh, because of this like 40 hp regeneration it's not it's very good and you can devour that the ancients at level 20 that's great. That's it for this video. Thank you for listening and goodbye. Day. Night. For more information, you can visit our website partymmr.com or you can click on this video or this one. And don't forget to like and subscribe.